So this is how I code my BMW on folding the mirrors. Um, when you change your your uh, like your um turn signal lights, your brake lights to LEDs to um keep them from flickering. And you can code your car to pretty much whatever you want to code. This depends on what your car is capable of doing. It mostly depends on the year, make, and model of your BMW. Um, on mine, my vehicle is a 07, but manufacturer 06. I'll show you where to find that at right now. To find out your year and model manufacturer date, all you have to do is just open your door. Zoom on down here to your VIN number. So here's my manufactured date, my VIN number. Pretty much this is how I did it and this is how you can do it. Um, it's very old, basic and easy. Just push the start button on my vehicle without turning on the vehicle. Just turn on the accessories on the vehicle. You can do it two ways. It's best to have the car running. So it would need 12 volts at all times, 12, 13 volts at all times for it to uncode the car. So it'll tell you that just to be on the safe side. So you can have your car running and coding it. In this case, I'm just going to turn on the accessory button so we'll see how the lights come on right here turn on Wi-Fi and look for networks we're gonna look for the Carly adapter connect to it once it's connected close it and then right here you want to go to connect connect you have to um, do this every time you um, try to connect your adapter so I'm connect it and from here you just go to coding it's gonna tell you um, how many uh, modules your car has and they're able to code so it'll tell you this just hit continue so now it's gonna tell you that just hit the bottom continue so on my vehicle it found seven of them so pretty much this will it will say this and all I have to do is just hit okay and these are all the things I could mess around with on my vehicle I can code whatever not everything will be abled so right here I want to do the do the mirrors and the lights so pretty much I'm gonna go into here the app will make a backup of every time you log on to mess around with the um, settings so pretty much I could restore or read from whatever I messed with before. So I'm gonna go to read out and pretty much let it read read uh, my file that I settings that I had um, ready messed with before. Activate the folding mirrors. All I have to do is hit active on mirror one. I will say driver side. All I have to hit is active on mirror two. I will say passenger side. And I will have to hit comfort folding for side mirrors active. And right here will give you a brief description of what I'm doing. You can pause this and read it real quick. And all I have to do is just hit code now. Once I hit code now, it will code my vehicle and I'll be able to fold my mirrors. 
with my key. So my reverse lights warning are active. As you can see on on my dashboard, the lights, um, the car is notifying me that the reverse lights are um, burnt out, but they're not because they're LEDs. So if I want to disable that warning light, I just hit non-active, and it will stop that um, warning. On my dashboard it will stop um, letting me know my license plate as well because I have them active if I disactive um, it will not um, warn me on my dashboard anymore so on the bottom I'll tell you exactly what um, what the app is doing anything you touch on here and pretty much when I'm done doing whatever I wanted to get done all I have to do is just hit code now and it'll code my car to um, active all the codes that I um, selected.